Hi everyone, I'm Carly. Today our group subject is about Granger and his wife Ella. We are glad to introduce these two stunning pictures in the Granger's museum, portraying the musician Granger, Percy Granger, and his artist wife Ella. As you can see, these two pictures are very striking among all other pictures, and both of the, both of them when, were painted when these two couples are in the twenties. The picture on the right is about one meter high, and the picture on the left is a little bit smaller. Um, this two couple got married in the 1920s, and they stayed married a, until he, the Percy Granger died in 1961. They are a very loving couple, and these two characters are the two most important people in Percy's story, who together build the Granger Museum at the University of Melbourne. Next, my partner Sissy will introduce the, these two paintings in some detail. In this picture, the character is Percy Granger. He was literally the most famous Australian in the early 20th century. This picture looks like a successful young man who is 21 years old. And what I like to say about this painting is that he's holding a piece of music in his hand, so we can tell that he's a musician. Also, he's sitting on a couch wearing a fine suit, which means he's fairly wealthy. Besides, the painting's, painter's signature can be seen in the bottom right corner of this painting. And then, this another portrait is his wife, Ella, a Swedish-born artist who is painted as a young and beautiful socialite, wearing a fashionable blue silk dress of the 1920s and a brightly colored headband on her head, which is decorated with jewels. We believe that she was born in a wealthy and educated family, which can be told from her luxurious accessories and elegant gesture. Compared with the painting of Percy, we can tell that the whole picture of Ella looks brighter and more vivid, as it was painted later than Percy's painting. Next, welcome my partner Vanessa to compare these two paintings and introduce some more interesting findings. In these two pictures, as you can see, the dress color and the tie color are the same. They look like the couple's clothes. However, as we can see, these two pictures show some differences. Firstly, as for the background, Percy has more decorations such as the sofa, while Ella has nothing without a desk. Secondly, for the clothing, Ella wears a lot of accessories and it's gorgeous and complex, while Percy is gentle and simple, only the tie is bright. Thirdly, for the posture, Ella is more reserved and Percy is more relaxed. Last but not least, for the photo frame, both paintings have delicate frames, but the frame of Percy's own painting is more bonzer. We can infer that Percy had more prestige and status than Ella at the time. Okay, so in the end, welcome my partner Layla to make a summary. So, in conclusion, we can see that they were a very loving couple and lived in a wealthy family. Both of them play important roles in person's story. When I worked into this museum, I didn't feel like a tourist, but more like I worked into an artist's living space. Through Percy's artistry, the artist was captured the charm and the success of the young couple. Despite the passage of nearly a century, they remain valid and alive within the frames. Through their portraits, I feel that they have the vigor of young people with a positive attitude towards life. They are more like soulmates than ordinary couples as they understand each other's pursuit of art and can support each other's career. Okay, that's all about this video. If you like it, please give us a thumb up. And if you have any ideas or advice of this video, please feel free to leave a comment below it. Come here.